Hello and welcome to Late Night Gaming with Long Night Entertainment. I'm my co and we are playing some more Minecraft. We have left off pretty much where we are. I'm recording a couple back to back to help things along. We have ourselves our chicken coop. Yeah. We've set up our farm, which as we can see hasn't changed much. Uh, haven't really done much to change it. We have been focusing primarily on securing a better food supply. And that is exactly what we're working on doing right now. Because we got something else that we're going to farm. Because you may remember two episodes back, I was really annoyed because a creeper had freaking blown up one of my pumpkins. But it's okay. One's enough. One, genuinely, is enough. Now, while we're at it, though, we are going to take a moment. Okay. Hey. And we're going to do a little bit of uh, wood harvesting. Uh, boop. Focusing primarily on things that uh, we ourselves planted. Oh! Ah! Uh, uh, well, might as well show you. You can wear a pumpkin head. The advantage is that... Oh, oh, apple. Apple. The advantage is that the um, uh, Endermen won't aggro when you look at them and scream horrifically and then chase you in nightmarish fashion. Bucket of doom! There we go. All right, anything else? No. Okay, that's a natural one. Oh, lots of reeds. Let's gather the reeds. We're going to see about getting together one of my favorite food supplies, the pumpkin pie. Yeah. Gather some of these reeds. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Mm, yes, I see. Oh, man, that's going to be fun to harvest. Oh, boy. Uh, let's do this one next. Let's fall on my face. Oh. Again, we're just doing a little bit of resource gathering on this uh, during these earlier episodes. We're at the point, though, where this is not something you have to do. Seems a weird thing to say, but we're at the point where the next step you would normally be wanting to do is actually make a mine. Gather uh, mineral resources so that you can start the process of getting yourself here, of getting yourself um, armor, preferably diamonds. Start uh, moving on to later game equipment. Ah, there we go. Well, one nice thing about having some shears on you is that if you're really inclined to, you can shred through all this like a hot knife through butter. But I want it to decay. I want the saplings and the wood. Not the sap, not the wood. I want the saplings and the apples to have a chance to spawn and drop. So, there we go. And I think I mentioned in a previous episode, it's very important to try your best to get every single wood block out of this, if you can. Uh, Sax is going to be going soon. Yep, there it goes. Otherwise... I'm going to get left with floating blocks of leaves and wood. It's, it's just annoying. It just gets everywhere, and it messes up things. It's, really, it's just unpleasant. It looks ugly. Uh, anything else in here? Eh, we'll cut down there, there. Now you want to keep track of where your central trunk is, though, because let me tell you, 
It is so easy to lose track of that, cut the wood out from under you, and then... Boom. Hello, ground. Fancy meeting you here. Ow. As you get to building larger things, that gets very frustrating. And feels like it was most of the wood. It was a very large tree, but it wasn't one of the really super ones. I've seen bigger. I've seen some really big trees spawn in this game. Uh, keep going now. There we go. If we're doing this right, there's going to be apples and sapling and wo saplings and wood and Oh, manner of excellent resources just all over the place. Let's see any I don't I don't see any more pieces of wood in there. Alright, that that works for me. Uh oop, boop, 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 boop. Oh that's 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 just that's just right. Oh that's just so smart. <sighs> I just wanted to get my dirt back. There's my dirt. There's more of my dirt. There we go. Well, I guess it's not that big a deal. There. Thankfully, stone shovels aren't that much faster. Dang, is it almost evening already? I think it is. Anything under the water? Yes, some more soggy wood. A lot of wood, actually. Not a lot, but certainly enough. Anything else? Uh, as you can see, we got a, two apples. We got a good bunch of those. Nice large stack of, uh, of our uh, wood itself, of course. And that was our goal here. We're not even going to replant right now. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, yeah, we'll cap things off here. Oh, 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 I forgot. I forgot. We want more water. There we go. Huh, that's a new sound effect, too. I'm sure of it. I have never heard that sound before. I think that was the sound of things falling into the water. There are eggs. Hop up. Drop that. And boop. Boop. Oh no! <laughs> My poor chick. You have to be careful to go straight at the wall. Or else they can they can that can happen. Oh, I'm sad now. Well, let's uh, get a move on here. Um, no. Pop that. I'm going to plant this a little bit in the wall. We're going to put a block of water right there. That is a new sound. Put that there. We're going to plant a torch on it for the time being. Eh, no, we're not. We're not doing that. But basically what we're doing is we are making just a little bit of room for what will be our pumpkin farm. Should be enough room. Alright, uh, boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Grab our hoe. And boop, 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 boop. One, two. I want the light nice and strong here. One, two, three, four. That's the only one I don't know if it'll be strong enough to get to. You know what? I don't feel 
like taking a chance. I should be able to hit right above it. It's not that big a deal to pick it up. Oh, oh, it was, it was enough. It was enough. I didn't actually have to do that. Everything was fine. Well then, I feel stupid. It's fine. But my Cosa, where will you get these pumpkins? All you have is, where will you get these pumpkin seeds? Bam. They grow into stalks that slowly grow up and then will randomly generate little pumpkins right in front of them. Just full grown, not even little, just full grown boop, pumpkin. So that's our food. That will become our food supply. Reeds growing up top. Stay supply of eggs. The reeds will give us sugar. Well, that's doing well. Let's try this again. There we go. Okay. Nothing breaking, at least. And then pumpkins there. That'll make us pumpkin pie. Yeah. Now, in the meantime, I am just offhand curious as to if it is dim enough for us to just grow mushrooms in here anywhere. Let's find out. Easy way to tell is just to drop a mushroom. Say, there. And we're just going to watch. It's got to be a little dim for them, but it can still be light enough that things won't, you know, monsters won't spawn. I guess that's okay. I'm still going to lower the number of torches just a tad. Uh, maybe move that, plant that over here. Oh. When will I learn? Plant that over there instead. And I, mushrooms will slowly now start to spread. Uh, meh. Now to show you something here, leaning on the F, the leaning on function, F3. If you look over here, somewhere below me, right around uh, there-ish, you'll see where it says my facing, my biome, my light level. The light level is important. Here, the light level is around 10. It's nice and bright. I come over here, light level is 7. And I believe seven is bright enough for monsters to spawn. That's bad. So I'm going to plant one more torch there. Oh, whoa, 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 back to game. Back to game. Boop. Now, we check this, and we see now it's light level eight. Bam. Now it is safe, but should still be dark enough for mushrooms to spread out. Which was my goal. Sorry about that little blurry by. I meant to hit the function button. Instead, I hit the windows button. That is obviously not what I was trying to do. Oh, you'll notice no chicken anymore. Now it's four chickens instead of three, full size. Do they have regrets? Maybe a few. Now, if I look up, I can see it's nighttime still. So, we can figure out a few more things to do. Maybe pick up a little more of this coal. The nice thing about mining for minerals that aren't gold, iron, or anything you smelt is that. Instead of getting, uh, you know, just a just a thing to smelt, you'll get the item and a bit of experience. Now there is 
magic in this game, you'll get enchanted pickaxes. You can enchant them yourself. One of the things you can get is what is an enchantment called fortune. It'll make it have a chance that when you mine coal, redstone, lapis, diamonds, well, diamonds very important, instead of just one, multiples will pop out. It is pretty awesome. There's nothing quite like hitting one diamond block and seeing like four pop out. It is a glorious feeling. Uh, there we go. I'm gonna just fill this in. Time check. We also want to check the dirt, which is hopefully slowly spreading out. Ah, we are nearing twilight or dawn, rather. Ah, ah, geez. I love the sunrises in this game. I really do. I, I know it's not a real sunrise, technically. But darned if it ain't pretty. Oh, hey, look at that. Got a skeleton there. He's caught on fire. He went under the tree to get away from the fire. I might be able to take him. He took damage. Let's give it a try. Plus, I think the reeds are... <gasps> no, the reeds are not blinding him at all. He can see just fine. Great. Oh. Whoa, he is very close. Ah, oh, crap. I think I'm going to die. Run. Strafe. Ah! He got me. Darn it. What a way to end. Oh, well. That's... Oh. So you can see there's a village there. We can explore that at a later time, but I'm going <laughs> to take some time to at least attempt to get back to my base, grab my stuff back. Oh, th those things, those skeletons are why you really, really want a shield. So while I'm walking back, though, I'm going to call things a quits here. Hopefully find my way back easily. Oh, goodness! <laughs> Hello, ground. Hello, egg. So, thank you all for tuning in. If you liked what you saw, including my death, give that like button a boop. <laughs> and as always, oh, no, dead end. Thank you all for watching. Have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.